is brought to you by South Central Regional Medical Center in Laurel. Veins are the blood vessels in the body that return blood from the arms, legs, and organs back to the heart. Venous insufficiency occurs when the flow of blood through the veins is impaired. Dr. Hussain Nasajpour explains. The causes of venous insufficiency are mainly the valves within the veins. Uh, when the valves become leaky, blood doesn't flow in the proper direction, which is usually from the toes back towards the heart. With leaky valves, the blood pools in the veins and causes an elevated blood pressure within the veins. And that's what causes the leg swelling and the varicose veins and the pain that follows. Venous insufficiency can affect people in multiple ways. Some of the symptoms that people may feel may include leg pain, restless leg, leg swelling. Some of the signs that may be visible to patients may be varicose veins, bulging veins, or spider veins. There are many risk factors for venous insufficiency, the greatest being family history. Having one parent with venous insufficiency increases your risk to about 60%. Having two parents with venous insufficiency gives you about a 90% chance of having venous insufficiency. Women are more likely to have it too. Men are affected about 15% across the population and women somewhere between 20 to 25%. Pregnancy also increases the risk of venous insufficiency. Watch Health Break next week to learn why it's important to have this condition treated. To schedule an appointment for a vein screening, call the South Central Vein Center at 601-649-5931. For Health Break, I'm Katherine Farah. Health Break was brought to you by South Central Regional Medical Center in Laurel.